Okay, guys, once again, we are back and we are unboxing and setting up another Spirit Halloween animatronic. And this is one that was a favorite last year in 2022. And it's one of my favorites. And I didn't buy it while the stores were open. So I had to buy it from someone in the Spirit Halloween fan group on Facebook. I don't even remember how much I paid for it, but I got a good deal on it. Is that where I bought it? I'm pretty sure that's where I bought it. <laughs> so let's take a look at the box here, guys. Monty the Monkey, the evil killer symbol clanging monkey. That's exactly who we're talking about today. So let's look at this box here. It says Spirit Halloween logo right here. Monty right here. Arms crash symbols together, light up LED eyes and moving mouth, stands six feet tall. So, I think we're going to be okay down here, but let's take a measurement real quick just to make sure, because my ceiling down here, I think, yeah, is just short of seven feet. So, we should be good to go to set up Monty down here, but he also has the wide wingspan, if you want to call it, where he has the symbols and he has to clang them together. So I think if I set him up right here in the middle of the red carpet, I think he should be fine. I hope so, at least. If not, maybe we'll get halfway through it and I have to take it outside. I hope not. Let's move on. As you can see on the front of the box, we have a picture of Monty on his circus box. On the side of the box, we have a picture of Monty on his circus box. On the back of the box, we have a story about Monty. On the other side of the box, we have two pictures of the crazy, evil, symbol-clanging monkey known as Monty. Okay, let's spin it around this way again. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and start unboxing this guy. Oh my gosh, man. I'll tell you one thing. This box is heavy. It is a heavy box. So, we have some clothes here. And again, this Monty is pre-owned and pre-loved. So, we got to make sure that we have everything before we start putting them together. There's the pants. Here is some sort of mechanism. We got another part of the mechanism here. A Monty hand. We got a Monty hand. We have a symbol. We have a pipe. This is probably a leg. And this is probably another leg. Probably his shoulders. Is this Monty's shirt? Yes. Yeah, we have Monty's shirt and vest right here. Power cord right here. We have a Monty foot. Hmm. Okay, this is for the circus box. That's a cover. I guess that's an arm. Another arm, I think. Probably a hip hoop. We have another Monty foot. Hmm. What if it what if you could make a phone out of Monty's foot? You'd be like, hello! Hello! We got directions. We have Monty's head! Look how enormous this head is. Oh my gosh. Hello. <laughs> Holy crap, that's a big head right there. Mister, you have a big head. All right, we have the other hand with the other symbol here. And we have Monty's box. Make sure we got everything. We got the box, we got that, we got those, we got that, we got that, we got that, that, that. We got the head, the feet, the hands, the symbols, the arms, pants, the shirt, box cover, and those two black things. So we're good to go there and we are ready to start building Monty the evil symbol clashing killer monkey from Spirit Halloween. Let me look at this box here a second. This part goes in the front. Um, I don't even know. I'm gonna have to move my table. So right here ought to be okay. He stands on this box and has his arms out like this. So this will be interesting. All right, this one goes in the front. B goes in the back. Oh, wait a minute. No, 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 no. I forgot to put this on. This is supposed to go on first. Okay, there we go. Now we're doing it right. Now Monty's feet go on. In there. Something like that. Now the pants. What in the heck? Okay. Next we got this piece. There's that. 
put our power cord in there first before we do anything else. Okay, yeah, the hip hoop. I knew that's what this would be. Okay, then pull the pants up over that. So far, so good. And we need this part right here. And this one. Alright, this part's kind of bent, so I gotta bend it back. So, shirt. And this is where the sensor goes. There's a little hole there. No. I think that's right. Okay, so this one. Up through the sleeve. Who the heck is it? Okay. And then this one. One. Now the other one here, I have to find a screw. Oh, never mind, it's in the hand. Okay, I'm gonna have to put some duct tape on here. The symbol has broken off of the hand. Anyway, whatever, you know what I'm trying to say there. Not a permanent fix, but it is a quick fix. All right. The box says six feet tall, guys. We measured this, and the ceiling is seven feet tall. His head is going to touch the ceiling. All right, here we go. Got wires sticking out. Wow. All right, so his head is not touching the ceiling. We still got about six inches there, but man, I thought for sure he would. I'm not that big. <laughs> he looks pretty good. Plug him in and turn him on. Maybe that's all the farther his arms go out. I thought that they went out like way out. You gotta love Monty. Look at that guy. <laughs> yeah, I thought that his arms opened up like a lot more. He is pretty cool, man. I want to build him his own cage, kind of like what they had at the spirit stores. But I want to put, like, bars all around the whole thing. That would be totally awesome. For some reason, I'm also just itching to put this pirate hat on him. Hello, pirates! <laughs> Arr! I don't think that stowaway is very happy with me. All right, let's get a good look at him here. Head to toe, all the way down, He's standing on his circus box. There's his giant feet, his clanging cymbal hands, and his face in which he has the whitest of white teeth and definitely does not need the Aqua Fresh. All right, guys, well, there he is. Mr. Monty clanging away. He is huge and he is awesome. I am so very glad that I ended up buying him. He's super loud too. All right, Monty, one more time. Do your stuff.